are at Vivatech, it's coming to its end. We are Saturday and it's a general public day after three intensive BTV days. Hello, Romain. Hello, Céline. What is your main takeaway of Vivatech this year? Well, if we focus on our booth, Exoskeleton and the autonomous robot from DPD UK were really crowded. A lot of people wanted to try, to touch it. Even the kids for this uh, last day went to take their, ki their um, candies inside uh, the robot. So it was really something, you know, a lot of people, dynamic, a lot of brand image for us. It was really nice. If we go on Vivatech globally, a lot of people, we have seen Emmanuel Macron, we have seen Elon Musk, so a lot of people. We have also that part dedicated to eSports, and I think that's something important. Maybe you want to know more about it. Yeah, I would like to know more because I actually didn't have time to go to the eSports hall. <laughs> so we'd be curious to know what was in there. Yeah, you know, it's like between laser and sport. Uh, so for example, you could try like a simulator where you put a VR cast and you are like driving a car and you have all the movement. You could do a roller coaster and when you go out, you are not feeling like if you didn't do it, you are feeling like if you are going outside of Disneyland after your roller coaster, like a real one. So really immersive technology, immersive solution and really amazing part. Okay. I could see also at Vivatech that there are many stages with lots of conferences happening. If you would have to pick one topic or one speaker that you particularly appreciate it. I would not speak about CMO because obviously it's our group and I think it was really nice because it's a really important topic for us food. If we go outside of that topic, that are our own topic, uh, I think the best one uh, was one from uh, Bernard Arnault, which was really insightful with a lot of information about how they try to integrate the new technology inside the field. You know, luxury, we could think it's just makeup and stuff like that, but really they try to change the customer experience and make it friendly, easy, and it feel like what we are doing. It's why we have the autonomous robot. To have our customer really happy, something easy, smooth. So we feel like, yeah, something that is uh, important for us and for them, and it was really insightful. Okay, are you looking forward to next year? I think maybe seeing, you know, we have seen a lot of about AI that year, because obviously it's the main topic, but it was really starting first MVP, first solution, and we are really waiting for more structured solution that we could implement easily in our business. So I think, yeah, AI, but structured and more developed solution. Okay, so we'll meet again at Pivotech 2024, which promises to be really complete because it will be the Olympic Games here. So I'm really looking forward to it. Thank you, Roma. Thank you, Celine.